Hi, how's it going everybody? My name is Darren and I'm here with Hilltop Camper and RV and today we're going to be talking about the 2021 Jfeather 24BH. As you can see, there is a lot to offer about this thing. So we'll get, you know, touch base on a few things outside and then we'll kind of go from there. First thing you kind of see is it does have a double entrance, one directly into the queen bedroom and then one that goes into the main living quarters. Um, as you can see, we have the outdoor speakers and awning with LED lighting that's all set to go. Um, one thing I like to point out as well too is the J Feather itself is made of what's called VBL, which is the vacuum bonded lamination process that goes into making the sidewalls and actually the floor as well too. It's got 144 tons of pressure held for 16 minutes to uh, make sure that everything holds strong and true for you. Um, as you can also see too, you know, like I said, the second entrance, you got your two different types of stairs. You got your normal aluminum stairs on the front that you can get into the bedroom with, but it's also got the uh, uh, step above stairs that are a little bit more sturdy, a little bit more, you know, comfortable for walking in, um, you know, everything as it goes. And then as well as, as you can see, a little ambient light behind the stairs, makes it so that it's easy to get in and out of the trailer. If you have to, you know, going to use the bathroom and you're not in here or just moving up, uh, moving about the trailer at night, it lights up the stairs where you can see what you're doing. As you can also see too, this one does come with the outdoor kitchen. So it's got your grill for you as well as your mini fridge. And then it's got a little slide out sink with faucet um, with everything that goes across with a little bit of countertop on it. So you have your outdoor kitchen on this one as well. Um, one thing that I like to point out with these is just like our other Jayco units, this comes equipped with that Magnum truss um, reinforced ceiling on it. So that ceiling itself is meant to hold 4,500 pounds, which is almost double any other competitor that's out there as far as this uh, roof goes. You might not think that's not that big of a deal, but here in Minnesota with the winters that we have and all the snow caps, that's a huge deal up here. So you can get up there, shovel it off. You don't have to worry about coming up to your campsite and your roof is caved in. So one of the big things I like to talk about. Around back here, um, kind of a fun little feature we got. One, we've got the ladder access that's gonna lead you up to your roof. So you can easily get up there and you don't have to set up a step ladder for it. But another thing we got is the rear kayak door. So that'll come um, so that you can put stuff in here, like again, your kayak, your bikes, anything like that. Um, it does kind of go into the bunk bed, which actually will flip up so that you can store everything. I'll kind of address that once we get inside, so you'll see that a little bit. But yeah, so we got the kayak door and everything as it goes. Um, let's take a step inside and we'll kind of look at a few features there. And so as we're walking in here, one thing I want to point out, I mean, obviously it's got the nice strong handle on it for a sturdy grip, but as you can see, coming right in, nice little door here. It's a walk-in pantry for everything that you need for your kitchen. So got full access to everything here. You can store whatever you want and you're not having to worry about trying to hide it in your vehicle or other different storage spots. You've got your walk-in pantry right here. All right, so inside this J Feather uh, 24BH, kind of the layout that as you can see right here. A couple things I like to point out right away is the nice double bunk setup that's in here. Um, comes equipped with the Teddy Bear Soft mattresses. These mattresses themselves are nice four inch thick mattresses for nice uh, comfort as you're going along. And then actually, like I'd pointed out on the outside, this bottom bunk is what flips up for your storage underneath. So this will secure itself in place so that whatever toys you bring with, like I say, your kayak, your bikes, that can all be stored within here, otherwise laid down for the mattress. All the, uh, the bunks in this one are made with plywood and not chipboard, so that's what gives them their strength. So each of these mattresses are rated for 600 pounds a piece. And then as we got here, this is where your bathroom is going to be. So it's got your stand-up shower, nice ample room for everything as it goes. And above the shower is actually a skylight as well too. Gives you a little bit more room and gives good lighting in there while you're in the bathroom. Um, toilet, shelving, plenty of shelving for all your bathroom amenities. You've got your sink and then above the sink is the vanity that actually has the mirror installed in it for your convenience in the bathroom area. And as you can see, there is plenty of room in here. It's because this one actually slides out. So your dining room table and your fridge 
all have a nice slide out to give you plenty of storage. So you've got your U-shaped dining table that actually does drop down into a bed. Um, and it's a nice sturdy bed as well too. Underneath here is more plywood like we talked about in the bunk. So that's gonna keep it nice and sturdy and give you a good night's rest. Um, the table, just a quick drop down. It's got a bar in the back. So you just pop the bar out, drop the table down, move some cushions into place, quick, easy bed. All right, and so behind the table, we've got your fridge and freezer. Nice little six cubic foot uh, fridge and freezer. It is a gas slash, gas slash electric uh, fridge. So if you're boondocking or anything like that, it will run off the propane power on there. But if you are at a campsite and you're plugged in, it'll run off that as well too, save you on your gas. Um, I really like these because I like how they fit the decor in to kind of match it, uh, the rest of the trailer so it kind of fits in nicely. Um, then you've got your uh, kitchen or your sink and countertops, very spacious countertops. And if it just doesn't feel like enough to you, it also does have a little flip up countertop. So you can do it, what you need to on here, what you're going across, um, making your foods and everything like that. There we go. So yes, plenty of countertops. Um, fun little spot here, extra um, electrical outlets. So you got your USBs and your normal standard plugins. Uh, for plugging in here as well too. Uh, you've got your microwave, your stove top, your three burner stove with backsplash as well as flush mount covers. So if you need more counter space, you can go right on top. But when you're using it, just a quick flip and go. Um, as you can see, one fun feature I like, lights up blue to let you know that, it, that it's got all the power on it. It's all by toggle switch as it goes. When you turn the burners on, they actually light up red to let you know which burners are on as well as the stove will light up red as well too. Um, it's got plenty of storage as you can see, all the different sturdy cabinets above your entertainment center as well as below. And above your uh, kitchen as well too. Plenty of storage for you to get whatever you need to go along with that walk-in pantry that it has as well. So in here, this is going to be your queen bed for your sleep area. Plenty of storage above the head, uh, above the headboard, as well as cabinets on each side with mirrors. It's got wardrobe capability as well as some shelving in it. Outlets on both sides as well as USB. One cool feature I like, which is actually behind the cabinets by your head, there's a couple of little storage spots. You can use it for phones, um, different things you want to store, or it could actually fit a CPAP machine as well too and it has the ambient light to kind of give you that night light or that night light effect and making sure that you can see where everything's at. Underneath your queen bed, it's got a gas strut uh, storage so that you can store things underneath your bed as well as if you're having things in the pass through outside as well, but you have quick access storage inside your bed as it goes. And then you've got your own exit out of the bed so you don't have to go walking through the camper it's got its own exit door outside of the bed um, to the rest of the campsite. Um, above you, you've got a little fantastic fan as well as some LED lighting that's run throughout the whole trailer. And then one thing that you can also be assured about with this unit, it has what's called a glacier package. So it's rated for heat and for cold. Um, so you can do a whole bunch of camping with it and actually camp later into the year with the glacier package that's on this because it's got an underbelly sealant that holds heat in as well as keeps rodents out. All right, thank you everybody for taking this little tour with me on our Jfeather 24BH trailer. Um, you can find this at our Fridley location as well as our other ones in Brainerd, Rochester, and Alexandria. Um, but if you have any other further questions, again, my name is Darren at our Fridley location, so you can reach out to me here. And again, have a great day and thank you for watching this tour with me.